Good day viewers, my name is Rosa Imano and I'll be your presenter for today's lesson for Design and Technology Learners, which is Aesthetics. Before we start our lesson, one should know that aesthetics is one of the elements which are used to increase the appeal of a functional produce. Today we are going to look at the following learning objectives. Distinguish the use of line, shape and form, proportion, color, texture. Okay class, before we go into details, we first need to know what aesthetic is. Aesthetic is basically an aspect of design that is not primarily functioning, but intended to appeal to a customer or a user by physical attraction, which appeals to the sense. The following are the uses and elements of aesthetics. Line. Line are the most basic way of organizing visual elements. They are usually joined together to create shapes, forms and space. Lines are used for decoration and for providing information. Shape. Shape is used by joining lines together. Shapes are two-dimensional areas enclosed by lines. Shapes are outline forms which often give products its distinct identity. Form. Forms are three-dimensional. Form is not always only aesthetical. Look at modern cars. Their shape is not only to look beautiful, but to allow the greatest speed at reduced rates of petrol consumption. Okay guys, let's move on to the next element of aesthetics. Proportion. Proportion is about the arrangement, dimensions and relative size of the various parts included in a design as a whole. A doll with too large heads or too long legs will be deformed and not very attractive. Allow me to move on to the two last elements of aesthetics. Texture. Texture is also referred to as the surface finish of a material and can be evaluated by touch. Texture has visual appeal. It can rather be rough or smooth. Color. The phenomenon of color is erected by the interaction between how our eyes work and the way light reacts with the objects we are looking at. Color improves the aesthetical appearance of a product by drawing attention to detail. I hope this lesson was informative and educative at the same time. See you next time and goodbye.